there are a lot of stuffs right so you can see we have uh, there's a plain dosa masala dosa cheese dosa I, uh, probably i will go for the cheese dosa because it will be heavy right so last time okay. i i tried uh, cheese masala dosa was in bangalore Probably we'll share yeah. some other exactly. stuff apart from our own dosas. Yeah, don't dosas. So probably the best thing to serve is, I guess, so the batura. Yeah, we'll take. Those, you know, uh, will be chana batura or something like that. Maybe uh, some lassi and <coughs> yeah, something for the dessert because they are already spending so much money. So why not spend some extra money yeah. for some sweet stuff? Yeah. So let me tell you that wherever you go, Indian dishes will be very costly. So, but Sabarama is decent. I would not yeah. say too cheap, but decent. Decent, yeah, I would say decent. So probably yeah, we'll go. But the Netherlands is very cheap. Probably we'll go for gulab jamun, gulab yeah. jamun for the desserts and. Uh, we just say it like try yeah. and. Just ask. Her. It's like two or three or something like that. How much we get it? And we'll take a lassi. You take a salted one. I yeah. take a sweet one. Huh? Okay, that's that's that's.
And in the center, if I break it for you, you have this potato and onions and the typical with the curry leaves. The this one is a little bit soft, so it's not sweet. Not sweet. Okay, so maybe it's the tomato chutney. Mm -hmm. It's not sweet. Tomato chutney. Uh -huh. This is good because it's not sweet. And after this, we have the chole butter and the dessert. I think we'll be blown out of our. And we have still to travel. And we are planning to eat dinner with someone. So it will be a long, long short day. Mm. No idea. But the dosa is really good. Mm. It's crispy mm. on the outside, and mm. I haven't. I like it. it. I haven't tried yet the masala. No? Mm. I just a little bit of the potato, and it's good. This is really crispy. I like it. If you like it to be uh, rich, then this is good. The, this one. Otherwise, there's no difference. The only extra I have cheese apart from the masala, and both taste really good. If you don't want it to be rich and full, then you can skip this and order the masala. Otherwise, it's great. Just pay one euro extra. Just just feed it. Just just feed it. Thank you. It's okay. It's okay. Thank you. So this is what happens when you don't have space and you want to accommodate the. So probably we should have should have told her a place for three. <laughs> There was a, there was someone on the other table. She was looking at me and laughing. I mean, she was smiling because she also felt the hunger. Yeah. Then we have. Yeah. Maybe they have microwave. But, but, but it's uh, warm. It's warm. Maybe microwave because the microwave is the best gulab uh, jamun I've ever had in Europe. Okay. That, that's a big compliment. Yeah, that's what we get me right. Yeah, you should. You should. You should. You should. Mm. I, I don't know whether you have. I, I think it will be in my top three. Not top the top one, but top three. Uh -huh. It's really good. It's really good. Because warm and. When when gulab jamun is warm normally is very I guess yeah when so, it's warm it's like mm -hmm. so what would be your overall rating so for overall rating I would say it me for overall rating I would say out of five I will give a four point four point two is not about four only so I would say four. It's very rare for me to give any food rating to an Indian restaurant anymore because until now I haven't felt the typical Indian restaurant because my reference is always from the typical restaurants, typical places, so it's different. So for that, if I take the reference now, and four is like really good. If you have an Indian restaurant which is like four okay. rating in uh, Europe, it's 
And budget wise, is it like moderate or expensive? It's like, moderate. I won't say it's considering the Netherlands price. The or Netherlands price, I think, if I consider, I guess even if I had it in Germany in Frankfurt, uh, the Shargana Bhavan, I would say you will spend for all these things like around 15 to 16 euros. So four euros okay. difference, I don't think is uh, mm -hmm. much. I would say 20 euros once in a month or once in two months is yeah. all fine. It's all fine. It's and great. you can always uh, do with less also. So yeah. Yeah. I mean, for me, it was like. Uh, 4.5 out of 5. Mm -hmm. I, I really like it. Yeah. Considering the price and the quality and everything, it's really good. So I would recommend you to visit it. Definitely in Netherlands now there are in two locations, one in Den Haag and one in Amsterdam. So I hope you like this video and don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Press the thumbs up button, like the video. Yeah, please like the video. Please press and the thumbs share up. Share among your share, share among your people. And if you're coming to Netherlands, you need something. Contact this guy. Contact this guy. He he knows a lot of things. A lot of things about the country. Okay. okay. See ya. See ya. Have a nice day. Have a nice day. Thank you. So till next time. Bye bye.